One of the things that um, I found really interesting in Project Lena, the book that uh, written by Dr. Tamara Gray and co-wrote it by uh, Antina Gia Maxfield, they talk about to take, for example, an, a negative, let's say, um, trait of characters that you had, and now you, you use it in a positive light in Islam. For example, if you were someone who is, let's say, stubborn before, but now in Islam, you're going to be stubborn because you want to get to a goal. You're going to be stubborn and let's say, okay, I want to learn how to pray right now. So you're going to focus and you're going to be, you're going to push yourself and really go outside of your, your comfort zone and be stubborn in that sense to help you learn your, 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 your Iman. Another way is, um, it's not easy to make new friends. Let's just be honest. Because many of us come from a life where, and, and it's not everyone. Then again, I don't want to paint all converts the same. Some people, mashallah, they always had good surroundings even, even before they were, they were Muslim. Other people, not that much. So for those that didn't have a good surroundings when they were, before they became Muslim, um, now they have to make a new community. And that takes courage. And that takes a lot of, of, of you have to be stubborn to really want you know, a new community and new people around me. You know, really starting a, a new life and a new way of seeing the world with new people around you. I remember... When I first, I don't even think I was Muslim yet. One of my friends at that time, she was a Muslim woman. She had invited me to a party. Mm -hmm. So the party was on a Sunday at one o'clock. I'm like, um, why do you party at one o'clock on, <laughs> on a Sunday? Who does that? And mashallah, it was, it was all girls. So for me, it was like, wow, that's very different, very weird. I w so that's something new that you never experienced before, that concept of... First of all, enjoying each other's company as women in the daytime on a Sunday. So it was completely new. It's a very, it's a very new world view. So even that you have to be courageous and, and be stubborn enough to say, okay, even if this looks weird to me, let me see what's behind it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> let me see what's really, you know, there, there has to be something deeper beside, behind this, this way of, of interacting with the world. Mm -hmm. <laughs>